hey, so I found a way how you can access Google VO3's video generation service, the fantastic one, today, even from countries where it's currently not available, like Europe or probably other countries as well. And you don't need a VPN and you don't need a subscription. And you don't have to hear it from me, you can hear it from the viral Yeti. Yo, my boy Phil found two ways to access Veo from Europe. One is Fal A, the other is Replicate. Tell him, son. Yeti out! So I'm not sure why he turned into the Liver King at the end, but you heard the Yeti. There are two tools you can use. So one of the tools you can use is File AI. And I like File for a couple of reasons, because you don't need a subscription to File. You just top off some credits, like you see up here, and you just use whatever you want. And File not only lets you use VO3, but they have a whole bunch of other video generating services, image generating services. So if you just want to say, hmm, the new Kling model sounds interesting, or I heard good things about VAM, let me just give that a try. You don't have to sign up for every single tool out there. You can just use uh, the, the file credits for each and every one of these, and they're really, really quick to adopt to the new stuff as well. And the other service you can use is Replicate. Same thing, you don't need a subscription, you just top off your credits, however many you want, and you can use Google VO3 or a whole bunch of other services as well. Now, one thing to keep in mind, generating videos is still really, really expensive. So one second costs 50 cent. With audio, it's uh, 75 cent. That Yeti video I generated set me back $6. So please give this video a like, because I really need that sweet YouTube ad money <laughs> to make up for it. Um, so yeah, use this with caution. And the bad thing is you have to use it a lot to figure out how a good prompt works because this is the prompt I used for my Yeti script and he said what I told him to say, but I also told him to move his hands. And as you can see from the video, he totally doesn't. Another reason why I like file a lot is because their API is really simple to use. So I'm using file a lot in make.com scenarios, for example, where I have written custom API calls to file. Um, so if you are daring enough to burn hundreds of dollars of credits to generate VO3 images from inside a make scenario, you can do this. So that's a really short video on how you can use Google VO3 today in Europe or other countries. If you like this video, please leave a like. I really have to make these $6 back somehow. And if you have questions on how to automate the file API, you can leave them in the comments or drop me an email. I'd be happy to help. See you in the next one.